Hello and welcome to the Eric Hamaneka Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce, joined by Stevenson Track and Field Head Coach Eric Hamaneka. Coach, uh, before we talk about last weekend's meet, um, a little bit more good news last uh, middle of last week. Uh, the new regional rankings came out, and the men were first on the met, on on that poll, and the women remained in second. So I'm um, obviously very excited. First time you've been number one. Um, just talk about what it means, you know, f- for the program to achieve. You know that that level of success yeah it's really exciting for us you know it always comes at an opportune time whenever the rankings come out i'm always out recruiting so that's one of the first things i can share with a lot of the coaches that we're out there recruiting uh with is that you know our program is ranked number one continues to show the growth um the thing that i'm really surprised about is you know the men's team especially just handled it like it was just another day yeah and you know we have bigger ambitions of the program you know we want to be top 25 in the country and you know our goal is to really win a conference championship this year so you know the guys aren't getting holding on or putting too much value in to that number one ranking but you know i just they should be proud of it it's yeah definitely something that we worked hard towards yeah absolutely it's something to be proud of but at the same time obviously it helps in recruiting it exactly. helps in things like that but at the same time it's not the ultimate goal exactly and then saturday um you guys went up to susquehanna a place you've ran quite a bit over the last two or three years and um had a pretty solid overall meet i'm just talk about you know some of the top performances on saturday yeah, um, you know, we haven't, this is the first time we've been up to Susquehanna this year. Um, kind of shows the growth of our program, trying to find different meets. Um, you know, very average day for us, but, you know, we, I think we did a good job. Dion Hicks and Kimberly Hammond are really showing their dynamic deal. The two of them could probably win every single event that they do in the conference. And I think the two of them are going to be competing against each other for Athlete of the Year in the conference. And on the men's side, you know, again, you know, Idris had a really good day, Langston. The sprinters had a really great day, 4 by 4 team. So, you know, a lot of solid performances across the board. Nothing that stood out, you know, we're hoping that going into this weekend is that we're going to get some of those big numbers on the board. Yeah, yeah, and again, like to talk about the, you know, we talked about this all year, it's just seemingly the depth, and, you know, last year it was like you guys were really well known for the sprints and relays. You know, now it's you've got Idris, you've got Langston, you know, guys that have kind of carried over from cross-country season, and, you know, the distance events, the field events, um, just that overall strength is much, much better than it has been at any time for you guys yeah absolutely it's just it's really great to see and you know it makes it tough when we're traveling to these meets because we have to leave some people home and we're just so deep and you know we're only allowed a certain uh, number in an event so it's really it's almost like putting together a puzzle every single weekend when it comes to uh trying to figure out who's running what yeah absolutely so um so looking ahead, obviously this week, um, you know, as you start to gear up towards Max, what are you looking for this week? Uh, so we're looking for big time performances this week. We're taking about 20 athletes up to the Armory in New York. Um, we were there last year. ECACs are going to be there again this okay. year. Um, so hopefully, when we come out of this weekend, you're going to we're going to have a couple of top you know 15 marks in the country top 17 marks in the country by both some of our men and our women um you know we sat demi and right this week uh, just to give him some rest going into this weekend so hopefully he'll have some big time jumps uh some of these 200 runners matt riggins kendall belzer vlad you know these guys are really looking to get some top quality performances out there as well yeah obviously the armory whenever you go to the armory in new york it's obviously you know big time me and uh you know usually some tough competition exactly all right coach we'll wish you and your team the best of luck this week and we'll talk to you next week Great, thank you. For Eric Kamadeka, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Eric Kamadeka Show.